Linky Bob the Trail, which takes you to the upper portion of trails at Lake Canopolis. This track, which I'm riding now, is full of twists and turns and one huge gully, which is amazing to ride for some strange reason. However, before the video resumes, I must remind you to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so that you'll get notified whenever a new great video gets released. Now, let's get to riding. Right, Linky Bob, which is a, I believe a green trail, or blue. I need to check that out. So, I've not, been, I've not been out here in a long time, and nor have I been out here, oh, now the wind started up. And I've also not been out here, what, well, since like, well, I've been out here since last year, exactly. So, it's been, it's been a while since I've been out here. So, that was full of water last time. That's just a, Oh, give up, it's a blue trail. And it's very overgrown too. Because <laughs> no one really likes this track anymore. Well, I think it's still part of the still part of the racetrack. Like when the summer series is on. I think apart from that there's nothing else to get used for. Ah, this thing. Based on that. And so the problem is it's summer and there's gonna be quite a few snakes. Well a possibility of snakes at least. I've had a close encounter with a snake last year, during the summer, and that was sketchy. But apart from that, nothing really has happened with those snakes. We had a, a brown snake back at Rock Mountain. But the only problem well, that's not, that not a problem. It was dead, so that's good. But, ooh, it's all there. So, that's the Lanky Bob. It's a very windy, switchback kind of trail. Full of flat berms and not really anything that's all that technical. It's pretty straightforward. Um, I think that where to be? Ah, here we go. And this is something that's actually very difficult. I can I can not like this one. So you either go that way, straight down that huge drop down there. It's not only drop it's that's just more of a very steep roll. Or down there, it's a bit more mellow. Consistent. I'm going to take the A-line attempt. Let's see how I go with this one. Let me try. Oh, it's a... Geronimo! Ah, piece of cake. Easy. Right, now for the beeline approach, which is a lot more consistent. Ha -ha. That was a lot of fun. Right. Okay, so that was... That's about the last of the um, windy switchbacks. And Linky Bob just more or less takes you out to the other end of Lake Knowles tracks. So it gets, it gets you to the more blue and black technical trails a lot faster. In my eyes at least. <laughs> I don't know what that was. So. 
working up to the end here. Got his last little bit here that should join back onto the Those arrows join back onto Rockwell Valley and that just gives you a clearer view of oh, it allows you to go back to the to car park a lot quicker though. So along here and just Along here, and then up to the end, which is up here. And that is the end of Windy Bob. Pretty straightforward, nothing too technical or difficult. So, if you like the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and share with anyone you might not know who knows, who you might not know, who you may know who may not know the trail all that well. There you go, said it. Ha. And don't forget to Right. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you're new. And I'd like to see any more great content like this. And so I'd also like to remind you to commit to everything, ride everything, and shred everything. Bye!